Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Following my dramatic success at the Workman's Institute Penge, I'm presenting this afternoon in our fresco for the very first time a few very, very success, uh, successful and highly dramatic quick changes. First will be done, if I may say so, in the amazingly short time of 11 seconds flat. And here's, I think, I can claim quite safely to be the only one in Europe performing these amazing feats before your very eyes, without extra paraphernalia whatsoever, no trickery, no, nothing at all. May I present, ladies and gentlemen, my impersonation in 11 seconds flat, before your very eyes, of Her Royal Highness, Princess Margaret! <laughs> Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Having had some success with my last uh, impersonation, uh, this is the final one, the final one that I would like to present to you. And it is an extremely difficult one, because I'm going to present uh, my, my great piece of resistance, which is uh, Queen Victoria, as she appeared at the opening of the Crystal Palace, if you remember, which was opened in Crystal. And um, uh, here, then, in, uh, this may take me longer than 10 seconds, is uh, her, um, her Majesty Queen Victoria, and I shall present, be complete in all its glory. Thank you very much, by kind permission of Alan Eagle and Herbert Wilcox. Here we go now. <laughs> I'm afraid I shall have to confess that I don't know what Queen Victoria looked like when she opened the Crystal Bleeding Palace Bleeding Exhibition. I'm bleeding fed up with the old one. How are you going to kill this guy? You're going to give him the hand grenade inside the mouth that goes... You ain't giving him that, uh, you're gonna slit him up the back, fill him full of cement and throw him at the East River? Gee, Louie, maybe you're gonna chop him up into small pieces, give him the acid bath routine and pour the sludge down a drain. Well, Louie, if you ain't giving him the hand grenade in the mouth and the slit up the back on the East River and the cement and the acid bath, how you gonna kill this guy, Louie? How you gonna kill him? Mind your own bleeding business, dear. I don't know anyway. Cow, cow. 